Hello my dear students. In this video, we let's study about components of strategic marketing management. That means let's study the elements of a strategic marketing management. The strategic marketing management consists of different components. They are brand loyalty, brand positioning, brand resonance, crisis marketing, unique selling proposition. In this video, first let's study about uh, brand loyalty. Brand loyalty. Before going to study about brand loyalty, first let's see the meaning of uh, brand. Branding is one of the important decision in product mix and in marketing management. Brand helps customers to identify the product and its sellers can gain image and reputation and is aid to raise the sales that means branding it is an important concept in the marketing it it helps the customer to recognize the product easily and it also helps the company to have a goodwill and to increase the sales let's see the meaning of a brand according to american marketing association a brand is a name term symbol or a design or a combination of them which is intended to identify the goods or services of one seller or a group of seller and to differentiate from from those of competitors on the other hand branding is a process of finding and fixing the means of identification that means a brand is a name mark or symbol number letter or any other words or combination of all these given to a product in order to identify the product of a seller and differentiate them from the competitors means here a brand is nothing but name or symbol given to a particular product in order to identify that product and differentiate from the competitors that is a brand i hope you clear with the term brand uh, you can uh, give, uh, for example in case of shampoos there are different companies launches the different shampoos shampoo is a product out of that there are different competitors in the shampoo itself for example it may be sun silk pantene head and shoulders how you identify the company's product on the basis of their name like pantene sun silk or uh, uh, pro, uh, then head and shoulders like that that name itself is called as a brand then in today's fast faced instant gratification world there are more choices than ever before companies are constantly coming coming up with new ways to try and get as many eyes on the product as possible that's why establishing brand loyal customer base is crucial in today's market businesses plan different creative marketing strategies like reward and loyalty programs incentives trials and brand ambassadors to create brand loyalty in the modern competitive world new and similar products will be introduced by the competitors so this involves difficulty in retaining the customers and market share for the product in marketing this leads to have and establish loyal customer for the product so brand loyalty concept become very important in marketing brand loyalty is based upon emotional involvement which is created between the brand and the consumer that means this loyalty is mainly based on the customer's emotion on a product that means here the customer perceived that the brand will fulfill their some type of emotional want in a unique way and that emotions evokes during the process of purchasing and using it so this loyalty is main based on the emotion of the uh, customers or consumers towards the particular product brand loyalty is the tendency of consumers to continuously purchase one brand's product over another that means brand loyalty is a 
tendency or the consumers buy the product from the same manufacturer repeatedly and they do not purchase a substitute brand in case the preferred brand is unavailable that means here brand loyalty is or uh, brand loyalty means here the consumer continuously purchases a, a particular product a particular product then uh, this brand loyalty is mainly related to a product not to a company okay this brand loyalty is mainly based on a product or it is related to the product for example a customer he is loyal to honda city in the car means in the car in the car he go for the honda city only means he purchases the honda city car only that means he is loyal to a honda city that city is a honda city is a variant of the honda company so that he is loyal to a honda city car but when it comes to a motorcycle that same customer will purchase as the royal enfield that means what it indicates here he in the car he is a loyal to a particular product of the honda company that is a honda city but when motorcycle uh, cycles comes he is not loyal to a company that is he is not loyal to a honda company so he is go he go to purchase royal enfield means here it indicates that the customer loyalty is main, so brand loyalty is mainly related to the product not to the company i hope you clear with the, this concept next let's see the definition of brand loyalty according to the american marketing association uh, the defines brand loyalty as the degree to which consumer consistently purchases the same brand within a particular product class that means according to american marketing association brand loyalty is nothing but consumers continuously repurchase the same brand in the product class example in the shampoo if the consumer uses the sun silk only then it is called brand loyalty here shampoo is a product class and sun silk it is a brand name which the consumer continuously purchases the sun silk then it is called as a brand loyalty now let's study the meaning of a brand loyalty brand loyalty is a pattern of consumer behavior where consumer become committed to a brands and make repeat purchases from the same brands over time loyal customers will consistently purchase products from their preferred brands regardless of convenience or price that means brand loyalty describes a consumer's positive feelings towards a brand and their dedication to purchasing the brand's product or services repeatedly regardless of deficiencies competitors actions or change in the price that means in simple word brand loyalty is nothing but loyalty of a buyer towards a particular brand or particular product in simple the repurchasing of a particular brand product is a brand loyalty then let's see the importance of brand loyalty brand loyalty helps in building a strong customer base that means brand loyalty retain the customers so it helps the company to create and build a strong customer base because of the building a strong customer base it helps as a tool to surpass competitors and attain a competitive edge that is required to succeed in the market place then next one it is a repeated purchases of its product and services means repeated purchases means continuously purchase of the same products companies having strong brand loyalty customers experience repeated purchase of its product and services regardless of the fact that there is a change in price or convenience means here the consumer repeatedly continuously purchase the same brand 
customer will continue using the products and services of a particular company continuously using the products and services that means loyal customer of a particular brand are less likely to get influenced by the marketing efforts of competitors thereby increasing the probability that consumer will continue using the products and services of a particular company then loyal customer may turn into brand ambassadors for the company that means here brand uh, loyalty is, is like a free promotion or it is a tool for the advertising of uh, the company's product here the customer who become the loyal they turn into the brand ambassadors brand ambassadors means uh, they directly promote the products to the potential customers why they become the uh, why they promote the product because those loyal customers are satisfied with the brand and they will spread the brand awareness providing the business costless marketing so the loyal customer satisfied the uh, products products or brand of the company because of that they promote the their brands then a loyal audience generate revenue because of the establishment of the brand loyalty it helps the company to earn revenue means through increase in the sales and uh, it helps to uh, company to get uh, more revenue then attracts uh, new potential customers every time a consumer uh, enters the brand it brings much closer to earning a new customer because of the uh, loyal customers it helps the company to attract the new customers so because of that reason this brand loyalty plays important in the marketing of a product this importance also you can write for the benefits or advantages of a brand loyalty then next one is a uh, levels of brand loyalty brand loyalty means uh, the steps or the stages in the brand loyalty there are three levels of brand loyalty like brand recognition brand preference brand insistence first brand recognition recognition the term itself indicates recognition recognition of the particular brand this recognition is the first step in brand loyalty before consumer can form an impression of the brand uh, the company first need to expose to it means the company first it promote the brand to the prospective customers once the customer recognizes the brand then the customer become familiar with the product and they are likely to buy it so first brand recognition is the important step or important stage in the brand loyalty then next one is a brand preference when someone prefers particular brand it means uh, the customer will choose that brand over another if all things are equal however they may still be swayed by competitors taking additional steps to appeal to the audience so because of that reason it is important to create a brand identity and maintain it every point in the company's growth here brand preference means in simple way here the cons customers they prefer a particular brand but there is a chance that the competitors can attract the such a customers so the company must build a strong brand loyalty then brand insistence at this stage the people will not accept any substitute that means they are not attracted by the competitors action at this level particular brand is no longer compared to other competitors it is the highest level in the uh, highest level in the brand loyalty and the level every business is striving for with this audience means every company want to achieve this brand insistency to 
कस्टाब्रिज द ब्रांड लॉयल्टी सो ई होप यू क्लियर विथ दिस लेवल्स ऑफ ब्रांड लॉयल्टी मीन इन द फर्स्ट स्टेप ब्रांड रेकग्नेशन द कंपनी मस्ट एडवर्टाइज द प्रोडक्ट एंड मेक् दम मेक् द कस्टमर्स टू ऐडेंटिफाई द प्रोडक्ट दट इस ब्रांड रेकग्नेशन देन ब्रांड प्रिफरेन्स हियर वन द कस्टमर ऐडेंटिफाई दे सैटिसफाइड सो दैट दे स्टार्टेड टू प्रिफर और बै द प्रोडक्ट बट देर इज अ चांस दैट द कॉम्पिटेटर्स मे अट्रैक्ट दैम सो बिकॉज ऑफ दैट रीजन द कंपनी मस्ट एस्टाब्लिश अ ब्रांड लॉयल्टी इन अ स्ट्रांग वे इन ब्रांड इंसिस्टेंसी इट इज अ लास्ट लास्ट स्टेप और लास्ट लेवल इन ब्रांड लॉयल्टी वेर कंज्यूमर विल नॉट एट्रैक्टेड बाय द एनी कॉम्पिटेटर्स एक्शन दे कंटिन्यूसली परचेसिंग द द पर्टिक्युलर ब्रांड सो दीज आर द थ्री लेवल्स ऑफ ब्रांड लॉयल्टी कंक्लूजन ब्रांड लॉयल्टी इज नॉट समथिंग यू कैन वाइप आउट of nowhere it start with the brand strategy and work with team to identify gaps with your audience once you do all you have to do is continue posturing it and the support will follow that means brand loyalty can be started with the strategy and it ends with the building a good relationship through building a brand loyalty company can retain the customer and build goodwill and increase the sales so i hope you clear with the brand loyalty concepts if you have any doubts please clarify it thank you